We don't have it figured out. We don't have it all together. We don't have to, you know, but we can seek the Lord. I love that phrase and it's very common in the scripture, seeking the Lord, seek the Lord. You know, there might be a fork in the road, right? Even just directional things in your life or just something that's weighing on your heart, whatever it is. And it's like, oh man, what can I do? Look at this, Psalm 27 verse four. One thing I've desired of the Lord, that will I seek, that I may dwell in the house of the Lord all the days of my life, to behold the beauty of the Lord and to inquire in his temple. Sometimes our answer to our frustrations should be like, man, I'm just gonna, I'm gonna seek the Lord. I'm gonna read that again, Psalm 27 verse four. One thing I've desired of the Lord. See this singular thing here. What, what is that? What's that one thing? It's God's presence, right? It's his presence. It's him. And God's gonna show up and reveal and bring us to some type of breakthrough, right? But this is where we trust Him in His timing. You don't need to go to some place, to some whatever. This ain't that. This is you, in the name of Jesus, can draw nigh to God. And He will draw nigh to you. Be encouraged. Be a God seeker.